Hey guys, I thought I would film a what's in my bag, uh, what's in my tote weekend edition. Um, what I packed or overpacked for two days as I always do. But, you know, it's all the little comforts I like to keep with me. I'm sure you do the same. And this is the same uh, olive green tote bag from Gallo Designs. I've had this for a while. And it just fits all the pouches in it nicely. So I bought a book. And I don't know, mixed reviews on this. And I'm only a few chapters into it. And I like the nature aspect of it. We'll see. Like I said, I can't really say anything else about it. I brought this wildflower book that I got thrifting a few weeks ago. Um, because, well, first of all, oh my gosh, look at those end covers. Aren't they gorgeous? So bright. Um, out of my comfort zone, but I don't know. That, something about that hot pink is very pretty. Um, I don't like the glossy pictures in here, but they have these like vintage um, photos in the back. And I've been doing some fussy cutting. And I've been putting them in this, um, just a clear envelope. You can see I cut out uh, some of the words from some of the pages. It says wildflowers. So I've been doing that. And I brought my Traveler's Company. Um, Olive Notebook. I actually didn't do any journaling in this this weekend. This is a print from At Sunny Days and Wildflowers. A little squirrel in the woods. You know how I love squirrels and chipmunks. And I brought my Motarm Planner, which I have been journaling in this weekend. You may have seen me flip some uh, stories. Um... I brought this little pouch that I got a few weeks ago after I saw this on somebody's Instagram or somebody's stories. And, well, she didn't have this one. She had one with a bird on it. It was really cute, but I like this design. And I had some uh, fountain pens in here, but I just took a spare pair of uh, reader glasses um, for the weekend in there. And this Luna Lisa's a design pouch with wildflowers. And in here, I have, wait, I'm trying to do this with one hand. Just uh, plugs, a sleep mask, and earbuds. And this pouch. And what do I have in here? I don't even remember. Oh, highlighters, pencils, and some other random stickers, just in case I get bored. Oh, this is just gum and handy wipes. Some of my daily stickers that I use and some other random stuff thrown in there. I can't open it here because I'm afraid I'm going to lose things down these slats on this wood gap yeah, here. This is, we got a candy bar, some fancy shop in town, and I don't even want to tell you how much I paid for this. <laughs> it, it was just okay. <laughs> I hate when I do that. Here, this is, oh, this is some more uh, fuzzy cutting. And this came out of the other pouch. I'm so afraid I'm going to lose this stuff. <laughs> um, this pouch that I got in Arizona on vacation years ago. And I'm actually doing this with my teeth. This is so bad. And here I just have tissues, my watercolors, 
some hand cream, uh, like sob, bomb, whatever you call it. You can, can you hear the squirrels? Uh, the chipmunks. No, that's the chipmunk. Yeah. And some Aaron's uh, thinking putty because I am a fidget. So I always have that with me. Um, this random pencil that my son got me when he went to London. But it's really cool. It writes in multiple colors. Not pen, pencil. An extra com pen. Those, those are my favorite ballpoint pens right now. Some hand cream from a hotel in Arizona. Lip balm. Lollipop. <laughs> um, I think that's it from there. And these are the pens that I brought for the weekend and I really didn't do too much writing because I was playing with the chipmunk all weekend. If you saw my stories, you would have seen us feeding them. We have our um, mama chipmunk had babies. So in here, I have my Pelican M200 and this has uh, Lay Artisan Havan in here, a nice beige sepia colored. This is my Sailor 1911 that I uh, just got at the end of April. Well, it was a Mother's Day gift, but I got it early and I've been using it almost exclu exclusively for a month. And I had uh, Tatia Olive in it and now I have, uh, what is it? Pilot Arushizuku Chinri. It's like a it's like a light green, like a meadow green. And this is a Jinhao eighty two in this milky green. And this one I need to work on the nib a little bit. It's uh, it's kind of like a hit or miss now. I know why they sell them in two packs or three packs because one nib works, the other one maybe not so much. Uh, I have a blue one that I've had for a while and I really like that one. It's a similar color to the, it's a little bit more blue, but it's very similar to the Sailor Shikiori Dragon Mint. And that one has been, I, I'm, I love the nib. I've been, I was using it a lot. Um, but I got the green one and I thought I wanted to try it. But like I said, I need to work on this nib a little bit. So these are the three that I brought this weekend. So, um, and that's it. And the chipmunks are scattering around here. Because I'm out here, they think I have food for them. Hi. That is Ozzy. I can tell by his tail. And we call him Ozzy because he's the one who bit the head off of the moth. <laughs> if you get the reference. Anyway, that's it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Take care. Bye.